glad you can do a, a U-turn turn. Yeah, and then come back the same way. Because that road's really messed up. Alright everyone, welcome back to Automotive Anatomy. Today we have Angel. Angel, thank you so much for uh, you know making the time, driving quite a you bit of distance it. to meet me. Um, a pretty cool story no behind this. Yes, sir. Uh, so thank you so much, man, for uh, for uh, being the middle man, and yeah. we'll get in, in, into that. No problem. Um, thank you. What do you drive? I drive a 1994 Honda Civic EG6 SIR2 model. Say that three times in a row. <laughs> <laughs> Nunca va a yeah, yeah, that's right, that's right. Yeah. All right, so what I mean by the middle person, thank mm -hmm. you so much. I actually found this car through Instagram. Mm -hmm. I hit up the owner. Okay. Owner says, thanks, man. I would love to, but the car's in <laughs> Cali, and, and I live in, you know, in yeah, another yeah. state. I was like, okay, well, that's not going to work. Yeah. Like, I'll tell my cousin right, right away. So you're the cousin, so <laughs> yes, thank I you. you got um, it. So big shout out to uh, uh, the, the actual owner, which is Alex, right? uh anthony anthony yes Sorry. sir anthony anthony and now angel, angel. is the one uh showing it <laughs> yeah. driving it around taking it to shows yeah anthony said that you were the better looking guy so oh, that's okay. why he yeah, had he's to... right he's right on that <laughs> <laughs> and they said we look he alike so. <laughs> <laughs> oh big shout out to anthony man i appreciate yeah. it thank you for you know sharing your build and uh definitely uh angel for uh you know making the time for us so angel let, let's talk about about you how mm. did you even get started into cars i mean where did that bug start for you uh, I've always been around cars. Uh, my dad started doing uh, mobile auto detailing mm -hmm. in, in 2000, so I was 10 years old. So I would go help him and clean cars. So I was always uh, intrigued into like moving them and mm -hmm. checking how fast they went and all that stuff. Nice. So just since then, and then obviously Fast and the Furious came around, and then that just even sparked it even more. And then just from then, man, just always loved cars. I was originally into uh, muscle cars, okay, Camaros and all that stuff, Chevy, and then my cousin like three years ago got me into the Honda. <laughs> yeah, he backed over to the good side. Yeah, yeah, he did, yeah. <laughs> Shout so, out to the Camaro guys. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so what was your first car? Uh, my first car was uh, 82 Trans Am. Oh. 82 Trans Am that my dad picked up, bought it. Dope. So I okay. was driving that around. But not that I bought myself, but that was my first car that I was driving around. Well, the muscle, the yeah, muscle, yeah, the muscle car. car, you know, kept the GM. But yeah, that was my, that was my first car that mm -hmm. I was driving around and got the whole driving experience Dope. with. Dope, yes, okay. Sir. And so then your cousin's like, hey, let's talk some, non some, some, some yeah. sense to this some kid. Some nonsense. <laughs> no, no, some sense to this yeah, kid. Yeah, yeah. Um, how the whole, did you have, do you actually own yourself a Japanese car? I do, yeah. I'm getting one built on in Arizona with him. You know, so you guys are just together. backwards, huh? Yeah, yeah. I went backwards. Yeah, correct. <laughs> I may have to go to Arizona yeah, yeah, and then to interview him on your car. <laughs> on my car, that's right. <laughs> like, hey, that car's over there. Go over there. What, is, what, is, what are you guys building? Uh, I'm building, a, it's a 92 EG, same like this, but just left-hand drive and it's a SI model. Oh. I'm doing a LS VTEC turbo. Nice. So just need a little, little pieces to finish it off and then bring it back out here and start having fun with it. <laughs> That's yes, cool, sir. man. Yeah, All right. Man. So obviously this car just kind of hibernates here in Cali. Yeah. Um, tell us about the story about this this car. How did they, how did it all get started? Uh, well, funny story is we went to go pick up a valve cover, a Type <laughs> R valve cover from HMO. Okay. Shout out to Steve. <laughs> and. Um, I saw the car parked in the garage and then I was like, I sent the pictures to my cousin. I was like, hey, look, they have this right here. So I talked to Edwin, he said, hey, what's up? I was like, hey, what's up, um, he wants to sell it? He's like, he don't want to sell it, but if you give him what he's asking for, he'll sell it. And I talked to my cousin and yeah, picked it up off of him. So we're just hanging out. You yeah, weren't even, you, you no, were we for a even, valve we cover. Were, yeah, we went in for a valve cover that we we're gonna give away just for, I think it was, uh, I think it was Christmas or Thanksgiving. Uh -huh. We were gonna give a free giveaway. And we saw it and we, we liked it, went to check it out, made an appointment, um, looked at it, checked it out, no rust and all that. And we picked it up, man. So obviously so it, once the car's picked up, like mm -hmm. what was the vision for it? Because it was stock, I'm assuming, right? Yeah, yeah, it was Holy stock. stock. Honestly, the, the, the vision for it was just keep it as original as possible. It came with some ugly EG4 rims, like... I don't know, probably like 15 spokes. They were just ugly, just, like Just dirty. wait, just wait, because those <laughs> ugly EG4s in, in 10 years are going to be worth yeah, more than these true, T37. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Just I wait, you. though, you know? <laughs> Civics and yeah. the bad, bad taste just go well together. Yeah, and then they come back, huh? <laughs> yeah, okay. but that was it. But just pretty much do the, the, the regular, you know, suspension and just make it ride nice. Nothing too much, nothing too extra. Obviously, just 
We'll see about that. Yeah, I don't yeah, know about real. nothing too, too yeah. extra. I don't know about that. But well, it's because the thing is, we, we don't know if we're going to sell it or if we're going to raffle it. Mm. That's what that's okay. what me and my cousin do. We do the raffles. You know how yeah. people are like, yeah, let's raffle it. <laughs> raffle this, is, it. this is a beautiful car, man. Yeah, yeah. So we're not sure if we're going to we're gonna throw it on bring a trailer or if we're going to raffle it. Uh, I don't know if we're going to get it painted first, then raffle it. So we still got to... Still gotta sit down and work out a couple of details. Yeah, yeah. See what either we're ways do. they get sold, and it's, yeah. I'm sure someone's gonna be happy. I'm telling, my, I'm telling my cousin, let's keep it. Right? We're not gonna find another one clean, you know. Like, but <laughs> he's yeah. like, uh, he's nah, like we'll nah. see. Yeah, we gotta get that money. <laughs> <laughs> I get you. I get yeah, you. Nah. If you guys decide what you guys end up doing with it but i think it's mm. a pretty clean chassis i think Thank that uh, anybody who gets it's mm -hmm. gonna be very very happy yeah. and so yeah um tell us about the front end what do you got going on the front end is stock i think they replaced the the corner lights because mm -hmm. I, I someone sent me a picture i guess someone was gonna buy it uh -huh. from from steve at hmo and they had uh had uh, yellow corners and i uh, had different wheels and okay. the front end is pretty stock. Original headlights, original um, fog lights, Stanleys. No and gaps, just, dude. Nah. <laughs> no gaps whatsoever. Oh my God, that lip, it's getting so hard to find. Yeah, has yeah. one little ding right there. You see it on the plastic? I don't, I don't. Nah. Over there in the middle, look. Oh my yeah, God. Yeah, right there, <laughs> look. Oh, uh, it bugs me, it bugs you. Yeah, it bugs me. <laughs> I'll be trying to cover it up with when you, when you put the little dressing so it looks all black. I try to cover it up like, nah, she ain't going nowhere. <laughs> no, but I mean, there's no gaps in the front end. Yeah, thank um, you. It's pretty straight. That's what Steve was saying. He's like, I don't, I didn't part it because usually he gets cars and if they're like rusted mm -hmm. and like, or just crashed and stuff, he parts them out. He's right. like, this one was really clean. I didn't even take it apart is all how I got, how I got it. Mm -hmm. No, man, I absolutely love the front end. And <laughs> obviously still stock collar, like we mentioned, yeah. in the hood, it's, it's, it's seen some, see some the burn. days. Yeah, <laughs> which, you know, uh, black paint usually black gets paint. that, you know, yeah. too, so. And black paint is the worst to keep clean, man. Like, it looks the best though it when does, it's clean, it though. It does, yeah, but it's, like, it's clean for like 20 minutes. And <laughs> uh, then yeah, I, I it gets dusty, it huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah it does. As you're cleaning, it gets dirty. Yeah. But hey, you know, it comes with the yeah, game. It comes, yeah, it comes with the It looks price. absolutely gorgeous. Thank you. And remind me, how long you guys had the car for? Uh, I would say like eight months. Eight months? Eight, okay, so very recent. About, yeah, very recent. And the entire time you guys just, you know, want to keep it OEM. Yeah. That's, too, that's, that's cool, man. That's yeah. definitely the way to go. It was a little scratched up when I got it. I mean, it's still some deep scratches, mm -hmm. but like, I guess it had like cardboard leaning on it. Oh. So like with the little movement, obviously it gets scratched up. Yep. So I, I polished it out and ceramic coated it. That way it just looks... Look, it takes away from the burnt part and everybody that's talking. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. you tell them, look at it from the side yeah, from far away. Side and look don't get close, yeah. gotcha. Okay, <laughs> cool. And then uh, tell us about suspension. Suspension, from what I know, it's stock. Stock JDM RS 1000s. Um, that's it, stock suspension. No, no LCAs. I think there's a sway bar back there. Mm -hmm. So everything is pretty stock under there. Okay. No, no, no modifications yet aggressive wheel and tire setup yeah yeah tell us a little bit about it um it's a 16 by 8 plus 35 mm. um 
Volk Racing T37 SL. And uh, I think it's a hyper blue. Very, very bright color. I think color. it's a hyper blue, yeah. I like it though, because the car is dark, yeah, it's subtle, we, and then that just pops. Yeah, that's true. That's, and that's the, the thing I told my cousin, because we're in between the mag blues and Ooh, these. Oh, okay. But I told my cousin, I think the mag blues are going to be too dark. They're going to be too dark. The car is already dark, you know, uh -huh. it's not going to stand out. Uh, let's just do the hyper blues. And we found them off of uh, Instagram, homie, EM1 Gotti. Got he gave us a killer deal with the, I mean, they're used. But uh, it came with tires already, so we got them how, how you see them. Oh, wow. Yeah, so. He tires look it. like they still have a lot of life. Yeah, they, 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 they're still good. And I've been driving around, so. They, were, <laughs> they, they better were, be. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you were driving it. Yeah, for real. <laughs> nah, but yeah, he gave us a good deal on those. And I think the, that, that color did it did it good. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. And then brakes. Uh, oh, yeah. Brakes stock. Yeah, yeah. Stock. stock actually needs some. I think this one's squeaking a little bit. Mm -hmm. So I need to replace, replace the brake pads and all that. Check all that stuff. Yeah, man. But it just, it's, it's so subtle. I mm. love the fact that like, unless you know, yeah. you know, that's you know, true. right hand drive, you know, it just gives you yeah. nice vibes, man. I mean, yeah, obviously the, the back, you've, you guys kept it very just OEM. Yeah, everything. Uh, again, there's no gaps in that bumper mm -hmm. to fender. It just is great, man. I absolutely love it. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, we were thinking about doing like um, the carbon wing, mm -hmm. but we're just like, nah, we're just gonna start taking it apart and, you know, messing stuff up here and there. So we'll just keep it. Keep it with the original stuff. Yeah, there's no gaps. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it looks great, man. Thank you, thank you. And now we're back here. Tell us a little about the exhaust system. The exhaust, I think it's a five Ziggin RO. If I can find it, um, I think it's ugly, personally. <laughs> and it's a little droney. Uh -huh. But high RPM, it sounds good. It, it rips nice. But gotcha. <laughs> Well, let's talk about the interior. Let's do it. Let's open it up and see what we got going on there. Let's see the bucket and the roll cage. <laughs> oh, wow. 10 point. <laughs> right? <laughs> this is absolutely gorgeous, man. One of the best, best, best seats out there. I know these seats are going for a high penny. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, the car smells very nice, too. Thank you. It's a new air freshener I just found, is that, actually. Is that what it is? Yes, sir. It smells like Japan though, man. Does it? Yeah. Like squash kind of? <laughs> it smells like Japan. So, so tell us, what, what do we got going on in the interior? Um, all stock, all stock, all original. It has the checker, the black checkered um, EG6 interior. Obviously original to the car. Um, one thing I will point out, I don't know if you noticed, it has two passenger seats. I did it. <laughs> I did not. Yeah, you see the, the little handles on that side? Oh. And then I can't buckle. I have to put it under the handbrake. So yeah, when, when we picked it up, Steve's are like, <laughs> uh, the other seat it came with, it was just completely just beat up. So I put a passenger seat in there. I was like, all right, that'll work. You're crazy. <laughs> oh. But yeah, as far as the interior, just stock. So clean. I think it's the, the steering wheel also is, um, I don't know if it was an option or what, but I haven't seen one with the, or many with the leather wrap steering wheel. Mm. Most of them are just like the little foam, you know? Mm -hmm. Man. Yeah, I wouldn't mess with this car. Yeah. Just, I mean, the carpet is very, very clean. Yeah. Ooh. We need the floor mats. That's what we need. We need like little pieces, the coin pocket. Mm -hmm. Just little things. Yeah, just little. But the, the overall theme of it is there. And yeah. So that's, that's what makes it, you know, look very clean, very cohesive. And I mean, this, this door panel seats, everything is getting super hard to find. And when you do, it's expensive. So let's pretend like you guys were to keep it. Mm -hmm. Any future plans aside from maybe potentially getting a driver's seat? <laughs> a driver's seat. <laughs> um, if we can't find the original uh, driver's seat, we'll probably just end up putting a Recaro in there. Okay. Just to give it that that look. We would want to find blue Recaros, but they're too hard to find. If you mm -hmm. find them, probably a 5K. And yeah, like, yeah. Nah, I hate it's you. It's too much, you know? But just keep it, like, keep it as it is. Just finish it off, the little coin pocket. And then I think the... Um, the shock little covers, mm -hmm. the little shock tower covers, they don't have them, so it needs the little caps. Okay. So minor little things. Yeah, minor little, just just to finish it off and just to look for it to look more complete. Gotcha. Yeah, man. Look, let's talk about engine compartment. See what we got, we got going on. See what powers this beast. Uh, a little D series, a little single cam. Single cam D series. <laughs> let's see. I swear, all these these guys just keep swapping in K. Yeah, so put we'll okay, see. huh? Put okay. Those things sound good. Man. K's away, no? Yeah, decent. I haven't tried it, so I gotta <laughs> find that. <laughs> and we'll see. Oh, yeah. I'll get you. Uh, I'll, I'll come thank this way. You, thank you. Yeah, well, man. This, this, 
looks very very nice but i don't think this Thank is stock uh -huh. okay just just want to make sure yeah no nah, um what the are we engine, saying? well first of all it's the b16a the original b16a to the car um from the looks of it when we changed the, the valve cover we didn't know it has uh, cam gears oh and uh as far as internals we haven't opened it up yet to see what's in there but it's just headers exhaust and cam gears from what i could see gotcha yeah man. and then what came with the coil right yeah, here it came like that so everything yeah, think, is as is yeah everything is as is but we only changed the valve cover mm. and i put this one from my older uh hatchback mm. the little box that came with the little chrome mm -hmm. you know, with the red filter and i didn't like yeah, it yeah like I that like, nah. come on man that's what jdm yeah but red and the blue i was like nah, don't throw it off <laughs> so i just put that in there just to give it i like the valve look. cover matches the wheels it does know? a little bit it is a little darker but Right, so cool. you know, and the battery yeah. as well, you know. Thank so it's you. pretty cool, man. Um, yeah. Have you had B16s in the past? I haven't, no. Okay, no, but no, does this, this feel a little, uh, a little fast, a little? It does. It feels different heavy. than my. It feels different than my LSV that I had in, mm -hmm. in my car when it was all motor. Gotcha. It does feel a little, a little faster. So there may be some other trickery. Yeah, in there. something, something's going on. There. Something's going on. <laughs> yeah. Okay. It looks great. I mean. What do you expect? It's a you know, yeah, a like twenty almost, plus, thirty yeah, year old car. Thirty years, and it's still still running. It's still doing its thing. Yeah. You know, it's just it's so cool to just see like again the mm -hmm. fact that this car was in Japan for so yeah. many years, and now we're here in LA, in LA talking about talking it. Talking about it. You know, I wonder who bought this car brand yeah, new. You know, true. type yeah, of thing. Yeah. Like that's so cool. You know, kind of takes you back to like that feeling that that person had when they first bought it. You know, yeah. like damn. It's it was crazy. a sport, you know, yeah. it's a sport injected a sport, sports yeah. car, you know, whatever you want to call it. Hot hatch. Hot hatch, <laughs> there you go, yeah. yeah. Y este no vino con, um, con AC, it was in factory option. So maybe like a light. Yeah, it was, I guess the SIR um, S came with sunroof and, and air conditioning, uh -huh. and the SIR 2 didn't. Oh, okay. So that's one thing I, I don't like about it. The sunroof, man, the sunroof is just... I like the sun request, but mm. I like I don't like that it doesn't have it. Mm, okay. Yeah. Well, you know, it, it, they're getting hard yeah, to find, so true. you can't you can't be you can't too, get picky. too picky. <laughs> yeah, you can't be too picky. Yeah, but no, this is true. great, man. I mean, um, has the car been dyno or anything like that? No, no, it hasn't. Just been driving it. Just, just been driving it. it. Yeah, as it is, hasn't gave us any problems, so we ain't, we ain't messing with it. Mm -hmm. But I mean, it would be nice to get it get it tuned and get it running a little better, you mm -hmm. know. Uh, for now, it's great though. Yeah. I mean. It's you, like you mentioned, you drove all the way to Arizona. Yeah, like, yeah, Phoenix, like almost 400 miles, and no 800 issues. 800 miles round trip. Nah, no issues. Love it. The only time I stopped was to put gas, but that's it. One time, probably. <laughs> and that, the, yeah, there you probably go. Yeah, 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 100%. Just to top it off. 100%. Like, yeah. yeah, this is great, man. Yeah, I mean, if, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Just drive it. And drive I think it. that's what it needs, you know? Yes, sir. A, a car that sits, everything starts messy, yeah, you know? That's so true. you need it to drive. Um, and, and it's not perfect because yeah. it is an older car and it's been driven, man. Yeah, so that's cool, that's man. That's right. All right, Angel. Thank you so much, man, for taking the time. No uh, big, shout, big shout out to your cousin, um, Anthony, for allowing us to learn about this car. Yes, I think it's super cool the fact that um, you guys are both in, involved with this. Mm -hmm. and, and it's just creating memories. And now that you're building your own car, that's right. hopefully you bring it out to Cali and yeah. uh, you know we'll interview you again on that, man. Yeah, for real. Any shout outs? Uh, shout out to you, first of all, for, you know, making up the time and and documenting the car and all that and getting to know me and all that stuff so appreciate you and my cousin you know for always dealing with the raffle stuff you know writing stuff down or just keeping track of all that you know doing mm -hmm. all the raffle stuff and it's pretty much it man my girl for coming with me to the show nope. <laughs> and Smart that's man. about it yeah, oh, well, appreciate you guys, man. Um, like I said, I'm just a dude with the GoPro. Like it's yes, actually sir. you guys that are building things, and yeah. you know, um, you know, just making the time. I think at the end of the day, it's it's you are gonna inspire somebody, mm -hmm. and I'm sure that there's somebody out there who's like, dude, please raffle yeah. it and give me his raffle information, it, yeah. uh, because I, I would love to have that car. And it's it's people that maybe are not even in Cali. Yeah, they're in in the middle of Somewhere the United around, States yeah, or exactly. in some other parts. You know, so it's just else, like you know? it's just it's one of those things, man. Like, yeah. For you, it may just seem like, eh, it's a regular, but somebody else yeah. out there is like, dude, I don't care about this. No, and to like, me, it's, yeah, it's, true. It, that's the one I want, yeah. you know? So, to me, it's a little, it's a little, still hard to believe, you know, that I'm driving this around because if it wasn't for the raffles, we probably wouldn't have got this car, mm -hmm. you know? But, yeah, 
shout out to everybody that, that joins the raffles and supports. But soon we'll raffle it for you guys. Damn. <laughs> hey, I don't I don't do raffles, yeah, bro. No, but I for this you, one, I don't, I don't either, man. I never win, man. I I, never I don't win. know, but for this one, yeah. I may consider it. We'll consider see. It, yeah. You know, it's, it's, it's hard to find a car like this, dude. Yeah. So thank you, Angel. I appreciate it. Thank you, Anthony. You thank um, you. definitely, you know, hopefully, uh hopefully I know it will go to a good home. Mm -hmm. I, I just know it because I know it seems like years are really set on, yeah. you know, the potential that this car could bring. So, that's right. but anyways, man, thank you so much for making the time. Man. No, I definitely welcome, do man. No appreciate problem. it. Man. Thank you. Appreciate you.